study orientation and college readiness among alternative learning system graduates in Northeastern Philippines. This article is written by six authors. First author Maria Mamba. Second author Antonio Tamiao. Third author Rudolf Vacaldo. Fourth author Phoebe Marl Pat. Fifth author Red of the Pagulan. Last author J. Manuel Asuncion. Contribution and originality of the study is that, this study is a preliminary attempt to investigate the relationship between study orientation and college readiness of Filipino ALS graduates. The results of this undertaking hope to broaden knowledge on the current status of ALS graduates with the end view of crafting educational policy reforms and basic tertiary education interventions for ALS learners. Access to quality basic and tertiary education has been the primary concern of the Philippine government. The World Bank has reported that a high percentage of Filipino Alternative Learning System ALS, graduates are enrolled in tertiary education. However, little is known on their transition from basic to tertiary education specifically focused on their study orientation and college readiness. Hence, it is imperative to examine these variables among ALS graduates considering its repercussion to their educational outcomes. This descriptive correlational study investigated the interplay of study orientation and college readiness of 143 ALS graduates, 77 males and 66 females, enrolled in a public university in northeastern Philippines. The results revealed that the ALS graduates have unfavorable study orientation and are not college ready. The study orientation also was found to significantly influence and predict college readiness. The findings imply the need for ALS graduates to enhance their study habits and attitudes as these are essential skills in improving their college readiness. Thanks for watching this video of International Journal of Education and Practice Volume 9 Issue Number 2.